Police violence against black people in the United States has been a long-standing issue, dating back to the country's history of slavery and institutional racism. While progress has been made towards addressing this issue, it remains a significant problem in contemporary society. The Black Lives Matter movement emerged as a response to the ongoing problem of police brutality against black people, particularly in the wake of several high-profile cases of police violence such as the killings of Michael Brown in Ferguson, Missouri in 2014, Eric Garner in New York City in 2014, and George Floyd in Minneapolis, Minnesota in 2020. These incidents, along with many others, have sparked widespread protests and calls for systemic change. Many argue that police violence against black people is rooted in systemic racism and biases within law enforcement institutions. They point to statistics showing that black people are disproportionately more likely to be killed by police, even when unarmed, than white people. They also argue that police officers are rarely held accountable for their actions, with few facing disciplinary action or criminal charges. Efforts to address police violence against black people have included calls for police reform, increased accountability for officers who engage in misconduct and the reallocation of funds from law enforcement towards community-based initiatives aimed at addressing the root causes of crime. These efforts have been met with both support and opposition, with debates continuing over the best ways to address this ongoing issue. 